Welcome along to the preview of this Sunday's Antique and Architectural Auction. It's a huge auction with over 900 lots. Some really fascinating collectibles and some super quality items. They just do not turn up on Perth's market. I would say this is one of the most interesting auctions we've had in many, many years. Look up Lot 50, it has all the history. It's an international standout sterling silver centerpiece. It really is a treat. Some beautiful collectibles throughout the wholesale. We have a great range of Royal Dalton figurines, Ladro figurines, brand new boxed crystal items never used, including Waterford, a huge solid silver German cutlery set, over three kilos of silver. There's some militaria swords. There's a really good little estate of jewelry. It includes costume jewelry, sterling silver, solid gold items, watches, really interesting items. And again, there's not one reserve. It's got to be sold. Two Wembley Ware kookaburras, as you see, both different colours. Royal Dalton throughout the cabinets. Art glass throughout the cabinets. Some really great collectibles. There's a little bit of Balik. There's a bit of everything in this auction. Look at that superb French cabinet, shaped with ormolu mounts. It's one of the best we've offered. There's a good collection of railway memorabilia, including a small steam train. There's a great selection of Persian rugs through this auction, all various sizes and colors, and again, to be sold to the highest bidder. Movie posters, beautiful antique furniture throughout, Victorian Edwardian, some retro from England and France, all over the world really some little Australiana pieces. You certainly will not find a better selection anywhere in Perth. There's quite a few clocks, some lovely bronzes, figurines throughout. So don't miss viewing. It's a fabulous opportunity to pick up some items at the right price. Margaret River Antiques has closed the doors for four months for renovations for their bed and breakfast. So all their items are up in Perth to be sold unreserved. They will reopen in a few months with a really fine boutique antique shop and a bed and breakfast, all decorated in the antique matter. So I'm sure my customers will love that when they reopen. So like their page on Facebook and follow their activity. In this auction, we also have a very big demolition from Peppermint Grove. All of these original fittings have come out of a home and to be sold unreserved. You just don't see these turn up on the market. A little bit of work and picture that in your home. We have a huge selection of doors in need of restoration, but what a great project and have something unique in your home. Most of them are the breeze doors that you can open up and have the cast iron panels so the breeze can come through. So don't forget viewing, it's this Friday the 28th between 11 a.m. and 4 p.m. On Saturday the 29th between 11 a.m. and 4 p.m. And the auction gets underway at 10 a.m. sharp on Sunday. We're gonna fly through this one because there's 900 lots. So bring your credit card, bring your ID. You will need that to register and leave bids if you can't attend the auction. And I can tell you in this one, you will find something you wanna buy. Prices have never been cheaper. It is so affordable at auction, you'll be amazed. So bring your credit card and ID, because you must need that to register. Have a look at the selection. There's plenty of original art as well. We have some great names like Durac, Boy Sivane, Cartwright. All the walls are full of art. And again, it's all got to be sold. So there's just no reserves. The floor must be cleared. It's a massive auction, so come along and see some beautiful treasures we have sourced over the last three or four months from deceased estates in WA and a container direct from Europe to be sold unreserved. 
It's a fantastic auction.